a little chaplet in honor of the Immaculate Heart of Mary. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Incline unto mine aid, O God. O Lord, make haste to help me. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Holy Mother, save us through thine immaculate heart's flame of love. Holy Mother, save us through thine immaculate heart's flame of love. Holy Mother, save us through thine immaculate heart's flame of love. Immaculate Virgin, who being conceived without sin, didst direct every moment of thy most pure heart to God, he who was ever the object of thy love, and who was ever most submissive to his divine will, obtain for me, by thine intercession, the grace to hate sin with my whole heart, and to learn from there to live in perfect resignation to the will of God. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. O Mary, I marvel at thy deep humility that was revealed when thou wast troubled in thy blessed heart upon hearing the message delivered unto thee by the archangel Gabriel, that thou hast been chosen to be the mother of the very Son of God Most High. I marvel at thine obedient response, whereby moved by God's will, that didst not hesitate to proclaim thyself his humble handmaid. In great perturbation at mine own pride, I ask thee for the grace of a contrite and deferential heart, that knowing mine own misery, I may attain that crown of glory promised to those who are truly meek. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Sweetest heart of Mary, precious treasury, wherein the Blessed Virgin kept the words of Jesus, whilst she thought upon the high mysteries which she had heard from the lips of her divine Son, and whereby she learned to live for God alone. How does the coldness of my heart confound me, dearest Mother? Obtain for me grace, so to meditate within my heart upon the holy law of God, 
that I may strive to follow thee in the fervent practice of every Christian virtue. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. O glorious Queen of Martyrs, whose immaculate heart, as foretold by the aged Simeon, was cruelly transfixed by a sword of sorrow, owing to the bitter passion of thy Son, obtain from my heart true courage and a holy patience to bear well the troubles and adversities of this miserable life, and by crucifying my flesh with its desires in the mortification of the cross, enable me to prove that I am truly your child. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. O Mary, mystic rose, whose loving heart, burning with the living fire of charity, accepted us for thy sons at the foot of the cross, whereby thou didst become our most tender mother and all the perils of this mortal life. Instill in me the sweetness of thy maternal heart and also thy deep sympathy for Jesus, especially at the terrible hour of his death, that so my heart, united with thine, may love him now and throughout all ages. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Heart of Mary, pierced with grief, set my heart on fire with the love of God. Appeal to the Sacred Heart of Jesus. Let us entreat the most sacred heart of Jesus to inflame us with his holy love. O Divine Heart of Jesus, overwhelmed with gratitude for the many blessings I have received and do daily receive from thine infinite charity, 
I consecrate myself entirely to thee. I thank thee with my whole heart for having vouchsafed in thy goodness to entrust unto me thine own dear mother to be my mother also, consigning me to her in the person of thy beloved disciple. Grant unto me forever that my heart may be ardently inflamed with love for thee and that it may ever find in thy most sweet heart its peace, its refuge, and its happiness. Act of Reparation to the Immaculate Heart of Mary O Heart of Mary, I honor thee as the heart most pleasing to our blessed Lord, and as the one most intimately united to him, I love thee as the heart of the best of mothers, and I rejoice in thy glorious prerogatives. Prostrate before thee, O Heart of Mary, I make thee this humble act of reparation for all the offenses which thou hast received from me and from all mankind. I humbly confess that I have been guilty of the greatest ingratitude towards thee, but seeing that through thee the divine mercy has so often rescued me, I venture nevertheless to hope that thou wilt not abandon me. In this sweet confidence, I am animated by a most earnest desire to be more faithful and more devoted to thee. I pray thee to accept all the good that henceforth I am resolved to do and to present it to thy dear son Jesus so that through thee my most loving Savior may impart his benedictions more and more on me and on all those who are dear unto me. Amen. Prayer of St. Gertrude the Great to the Immaculate Heart of Mary O Immaculate Heart of Mary, I have nothing in myself to offer thee that is worthy of thee. But what thanks ought I not to pay thee for all the favors which thou hast obtained for me from the heart of Jesus? What reparation ought I not to make thee for all my tepidity in thy service? I desire to return thee love for love, the only good that I possess in the sacred heart of Jesus, which thou thyself hast given unto me. I offer thee this treasure of infinite price. I cannot do more, and thou dost not deserve less at my hands, but receiving from me this gift, most precious in thy sight, be pleased, I beseech thee, to accept my heart, which I offer unto thee as well, and I shall be forever blessed. Amen. Prayer to the Immaculate Heart of the Blessed Virgin Mary O heart of Mary, Mother of God, and our Mother also, O heart most worthy of love, in which the Most Holy Trinity is well pleased, O heart worthy to be honored by angels and men, O heart most like unto the sacred heart of thy dear Son Jesus, whose clear and perfect image thou dost reflect, O heart of Mary, seed of mercy, full of the bowels of compassion for us wretched creatures, in flame I beseech thee, the cold hearts of thy children, and make them henceforth think of nothing, love nothing, desire nothing, but only the heart of Jesus Christ. Infuse into our hearts a profound love of thy virtues, and enkindle in them the flame of thine undying charity. Watch over the church, and continually defend her. Be thou the sweet refuge of all Christians. Be thou their impregnable tower wherein they may abide secure against the assaults of the enemy. Through thee, O heart of Mary, may we have recourse to thy Son. Through thee may we obtain all the graces we need for eternal salvation. Assist us in all straits and necessities. Comfort us when we are sorrowful. Strengthen us when we are tempted. Be thou our refuge in persecution, our succor in danger. Above all, make thy servants feel the goodness of thy maternal heart at the hour of death, in our last mortal agony, when the powers of hell assail us, that they may strive to take away our souls. Fly to our assistance in that terrible day and at that tremendous hour on which our eternity depends. Be mindful then, we beseech thee, of that power which the Savior of the world, who was born of thee, hath bestowed upon thee, Grant us a most safe retreat in the very fountain of mercy that one day we may be made worthy to glorify with thee in heaven 
the most sacred heart of thy dear Son forever and ever. May the divine heart of Jesus and the immaculate heart of Mary be always and in all places acknowledged, praised, blessed, loved, and faithfully honored and glorified. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit.